Hey everyone, I had to get my daily Animal Crossing fix, and um, I figured I'd do it live. There was an update to the game. Um, I think it fixed the duplication glitch that people were telling me to do. And, uh, that's gone now. Um, there was a mini Nintendo Direct that I watched while I was cooking egg. And that was weird. It really, you know, it felt like a lot more than a mini, yet I was whelmed, if that. It was mostly just stuff that I, I kind of thought was like, oh, this is a neat addition to the system. So, we'll talk about it a little bit. Nothing there really blew me away. Oh, fuck. Nook is... Have you seen this duck? Nook is remodeling. As mentioned yesterday, resident services is closed today due to construction. This may be a bit of an inconvenience, but I promise the island will be better for it, you'll see. It also happens to be the birthday of our dear, dear island resident, Louie. Wait, so Celia and Louie... ...have birthdays a day apart from each other? That's interesting. Alright, so I guess tomorrow is a big day. Someone said this is the worst day, but tomorrow will be the best day. So don't expect too much... ...from today's stream. Um, it'll be a short Animal Crossing stream. Short-ish. Well... I mean, who knows? It could turn into an hour and a half. Who knows? But... I I'd imagine tomorrow will be the one... ...that'll be much more... Uh, ...interesting. Oh, I may have a duck mask now, chat. So I gave Celia a wasp, and I got a present in return. So let's see, what did Char give me? Char gave me... ...a barbecue. Just like the... ...message said. Isn't that nice? <laughs> it's... ...looks good. Yeah, could have a nice outdoor barbecue now. Um, what else did I get here? Oh, Nook shopping, right? Cardboard boxes, yeah. That's good, I can make my cardboard bed. I've got another floor light. I might end up needing like seven more, or eight more floor lights, but... All tea. Oh, oh, right, the dodo tea. <laughs> Marimba. That's what Celia gave me. Oh, that's kind of cool. Thanks, Celia. That's actually a fucking great gift compared to a wasp. God damn. Um, I will talk about the mini direct, but you know what's gonna happen? If I talk about it now... Um... People are gonna join in five minutes and be like, Vinny, what did you think of the Mini Direct? So I'm gonna just wait... ...like another... ...ten minutes, maybe. Fifteen minutes. And then I'll talk about it. Again, there really wasn't a whole lot to talk about. It was just a couple things... ...that... ...caught my attention. Um... But it was... it was okay. It's really more... ...kind of geared towards, um... ...older stuff, or ports. And, uh, I feel like this is just to hold people over... ...for a little bit, until E3. Plus the, um, you know, the delays because of the virus. So, I feel like if the virus didn't happen, there's a chance we would have had a slightly more substantial one. But even so, I think they're saving their big... ...big guns for when E3 would have been, which is June.
I mean, they even mentioned the June Direct. It's a, it's a long time out, yeah. I mean, Animal Crossing's great and everything, but I think um, a little bit light to um, hold us over until June. You know, but we will probably see more stuff. I don't think we're going to get... Maybe we'll get another mini direct, possible? Possibly, but for now, I'm, I'm thinking that the most we're going to see is... Um, just a bunch of ports. I mean, Jedi Academy on Switch with online is cool. Star Wars Episode One Racer is coming to Switch. So, some of this stuff is a little wacky. Couple, couple wacky announcements we got here, chat. That looks so much better. The marimba looks really cool. Um, I need like tables and stuff. Eight without table. <clears throat> Minus. 100 to mood But yeah, like tables and like Places to put things on top of um, I got this <laughs> I mean nothing looks more clinical at least this is kind of cool cuz like I I kind of live in the dark anyway <laughs> like I like low light and This looks awesome like this plus maybe a couple of other lights across the place, I would be totally content with that. that. That would look really great. Dirt clawed wall. Oh yeah, I also got this. I mean, one of my rooms is going to be a trash room for sure. I know people have been offering me um, some stuff. I've been really, really, you know, happy about that. Like a lot of people have been offering me trash walls and a variety of garbage. And, uh, you know, I couldn't be more grateful about that, but for now, I'm just gonna, like, you know, I'll get, like, a little bit at a time. Like, a friend of mine gave me the beak, which is cool, and then eventually I'll get the trash. So, again, one thing at a time. Oh, wait, I don't need to do that anymore. I wanted to try to do something interesting here with maybe put the amp there, pedal board here. Detail mores. Gotta get the detail mores of the room correct. Right. So maybe. Um, no. No, so like the pedal board could go here. So it's like if you, if you sit on the stool, you can access the pedal board and the amp. And then the guitar, which is again acoustic, but I'm going to assume it's acoustic electric. It's a hybrid. For these purposes. Vinny, how do you get the strat? I don't know, I don't have one yet. But in real life? It was just at my local... Like... Music place. Duck. Desert, what is this? Decoy duck. <laughs> you guys don't have to send me stuff, it's all good. Thank you. I feel bad if you're sending me all your stuff. Um, but I mean, I had a decoy duck in the previous game, so I'm, I'm not going to be too upset about this. Let's see. Duck. <laughs> Thanks, desert.
Um, what should I do? I have an acorn. Like I said, a friend gave me a beak and an acorn yesterday. What do I just plant the acorn? A blue bear made it off the mountain. Isn't that nice? Vin, it's Louie's birthday. I know, I'm gonna catch a wasp for Louie first. Is that... does that work? No? I don't, I don't know what to do with this. Hmm. It's a crafting material. Okay. I definitely overslept. <clears throat> I I had some weird dreams that I I don't I didn't write down, but I I like said them. So I'm gonna get that information for you. That information's for the seven of you that actually want to hear it. Um, but I had some yeah two really bizarre dreams that I'm gonna have to recount on the stream later probably. But I do remember one of them was... Okay, here's here's what I remember of... I think this one I got in full. It was a grade school reunion 20 years later. Right? And it was all well and good. But it turned into... Um... Like we were in a castle. And then... Like we were under attack. From like the north. And we were in like this big icy valley. And, uh, Conan O'Brien showed up and said, look in the sky, and when you see the, the signal, give another signal. I was like, okay, Conan O'Brien, thank you. Um, and then that turned into me leaving to be like a scout, and then an ice dragon grounding itself in front of me, like, like an epic video game gamer pog moment. And that was my dream. I do remember that. Yep. Weird. Very weird. Um, a dream I didn't write down that, that I had last night was, and this is a recurring dream, is I can't find my locker. I'm back in high school, I can't find my locker. Because I didn't remember the number. I didn't remember which locker it was. So it's literally just me wandering around the halls of high school and or college, or both, Looking for my locker, but I can't find it. So that happened last night. But while I was doing that, in the halls, there was, um, a band playing polka music. So. So you know how that goes. Um, that was last night, and I have one more that I don't remember. So, yeah, I just have strange dreams with weird celebrity cameos. Um, and I don't really even... Like, I don't go to bed with Conan O'Brien on my mind. Sorry, Conan. I just don't. But he just showed up anyway. <laughs> Vinny, why did you put a bag of money in there? Um, it grows into three times that amount. Is the answer. But you gotta place it in a golden hole. Stonks is the is the correct answer. It's the short answer, yeah. Stonks. 
So again, looking for furniture and or a wasp. I'm gonna hopefully pay off my house today. Oh, you can't pay off your house today. Alright, so then I have some breathing room. Mantis. Mantis. Those claws could rip a tank in half. Um, okay, how many people are here? There's, there's quite a few people here, so I'll, I'll talk about the direct while I'm checking trees. No better time to shoot the shit than while checking trees every day. Um, yeah, it was a mini direct. And it was fine. And there you go. I just can't believe that ARMS is still... I mean, ARMS is a, was a surprisingly good game. I enjoyed it. But, um, Sakurai has confirmed, or they have confirmed, Nintendo has confirmed that the ARMS character will be the next Smash character. It's like, what, really? Oh. Alright. Well, I liked ARMS well enough. I'll, I'll definitely get the character. I'm, I'm interested to see what playstyle the ARMS who character would have. I think if... They should have included an ARMS character in the first wave of characters. Not as DLC. I would have been great with that. Um, but as a DLC, for, you know, for Pack 2, it's, it's a little bit like, huh? Really? But, I'm still interested. I think if any characters that they're gonna, you know, put in the game could have a unique moveset, it would be an ARMS character. Having a total blast, Peach? What's the latest? I'm practicing striking a pose. It's an important life skill, never know when you might need to pose. Are you posing as a blue bear, but in reality, are some kind of secret agent? The weather's been perfect, perfecto all day, so we're probably gonna see like a million shooting stars. I need to plan what order to make my wishes in so I can wish for all the important stuff first. I'll have to play later if that's the case. But, you know, it, again, um, anything character related that plays unique and is fun to play like Terry I've almost never played as Terry in any video game All right I never played those that series and Terry ended up being one of the more interesting characters in the game for me he was just a lot of fun he's funny he's fun he's got great moves Terry feels like like a perfect addition, like he fits right in the Smash family. Um, so I, I feel like, you know, a character like that, I'm fine with. But Terry's also a third party, which is what I like seeing from the DLC. So that's, that's also a factor. So ARMS character in Smash, fine. ARMS is a good game. I played it. I enjoyed it. Um, apparently it's also going to be free for a little while. And now's a good time for that. I think people might enjoy discovering it. But I'd be lying if I said that this was the most exciting announcement. It's just fine. Um, the rest of the Direct was also kind of just quote-unquote fine. Like, for me, the reason that... It makes sense that it was called a mini direct and it was just dropped with, you know, a lot of, um, like it just came out of nowhere. I mean, sure, people predicted it. The leaks and the rumors were true, I guess, but I think it makes sense because then you don't have jackholes like me reacting to it w with utter disappointment at the fact that we didn't get Waluigi or something, you know, um, live at least. So, as it is, them calling it a mini direct and releasing it as a surprise, I think, is is a, a way to temper expectations. Xenoblade looked good. Bravely Default 2 looks fine. 
that series needed a better name. You know, those are not games that I've played before, or series. Bioshock is coming to Switch. So, a lot of ports. Uh, Borderlands, whatever. I'm not really into that series anymore, but... Uh, XCOM coming to Switch is real cool. XCOM 2 is legit one of the most, like, fun strategy games I've ever failed at. Jedi Academy with multiplayer, with online multiplayer, is, is obviously, you know, I think that's a great addition to the library. It's, again, a very old game, but it is a good one. And, um... Yeah, so stuff like that is fine. There's a couple indie games that looked okay. Thank you, Diana. Wow, look at that letter. Jeez, aroma pot. Um, remind me, chat, what other games were teased or announced? Like, there's a lot of games that were available today. Oh, um, Panzer Dragoon, which I would like to stream at some point. When my streaming payload isn't quite as crazy, I would like to stream Panzer Dragoon, because it looks cool. Um, Saints Row 4, Catherine, the card games, the 51 board games was interesting. Um, I'm not really into that kind of shit, necessarily, but I was surprised at how decent of a package that looked to be. Action 51. So, yeah, a couple things in there looked kind of cool. Oh, nice guitar. Yes, that's the strat. That's what I want. I want to customize that to be greenish like mine, like bluish, like teal. I also, I like that, that toy, the, the ball toy, the balls toy. It's a kinetic balls toy. Then you can't customize them. I was able to customize the other guitar. The acoustic. Definitely want Newton's Cradle. Generic rock guitar looks like a Stratocaster, what do you know? Strats are just really, really nice guitars, I mean... Kinda hard to beat them in some ways. I mean, there's a lot of... ...great guitars in this world, but Strats just... I don't know, I keep coming back to my Strat. It's just a nice guitar. It's them springs, man. It's them springs. Les Pauls, they're nice. I have a Les Paul too, but I also... They're very heavy, and the, the tone is a little muddy for my liking. You'd have to probably get a better set of humbuckers to really get the most... Like, I, I'd need... For the, the tone I like, the Les Paul is not my friend. Let's put it that way. They look great, and Jimmy Page looks cool as fuck when he plays one, but it's... It's a guitar I've struggled hard to make work for me. And, and it hurts my back, <laughs> because I'm babby. Um, I noticed I've said a word that sounds funny, like humbucker. Allow me to explain. With guitar pickups, you know, the things that pick up the sounds of the strings, like that amplify them, so you get the guitar tone, um, there's a hum. And a humbucker is designed, it bucks the hum, so you don't get that <laughs> humbucker. Do you know how many years it took me to realize what that meant? Vinny, you can't say humbucker on Twitch. It sounds like something Scrooge would say. Um. 
but that's how guitars sound differently. It's like the wood, the strings, the pickups, the, you know, the stuff inside of it, like strats have the springs. It's, it's just a, it's a fascinating world to go down that many people, including myself for years, was just like a guitar is a guitar, whatever. And you can, tri you know, you can really make a guitar sound however you want with effects and amps. Not however, but close to, to how you want them. Vinny, would you recommend getting VR to play Half-Life Alex? No, I'd recommend getting VR, playing a bunch of different VR things, and then playing Half-Life Alex like I have. Make sure it's something that you want, because I think... In my experience with Half-Life Alex so far, it feels like something new. And it's really good, it's really polished. It's a really well-thought-out VR game designed specifically for VR. But make sure you want VR first. You know, you want to make sure that it's something that you like, that you can handle, that it's... ...a thing that you're gonna, you're gonna come back to. Because I think VR is, is just gonna grow from here. And, uh, we'll see. We'll see where the VR market goes, because I think this game is going to bring a lot more attention to it. That said, I don't regret my purchase. Like I said, I was saving up for it. I was making sure I had a, you know, decent computer for it. And I've been blown away by it on several occasions. Not just by Half-Life Alex, but super hot VR. And again, it, there's a lot of experiences in VR that I've enjoyed. But Half-Life Alex is, is clearly the pinnacle. So, yeah, I have no regrets. I'm, I'm enjoying it. I just need to play it when my mind isn't fucked, because... Doing the, um... Oh man, I don't think I have that bug. Uh, I don't have a net either. Shit. Um, VR with smooth movement is still new to me, and yesterday I was coming off of feeling like shit. From the previous day. And I had to stop my stream a little early. I still did like an hour 40 of Half-Life Alex, but if it were up to me, I think I probably would have gone another half hour. Rock guitar. Oh, you fuck. Just a sticker? Oh, man. Guess I could get a meat on there. It's not even worth it. Vinny, I got a red one if you want a red one. Um, a bluish-green one would be perfect, but I'll, I'll take the yellow one for now. Can refund the game entirely. Nintendo, I don't want your Animal Crossing anymore, fuck you. Vinny, I have a teal one. I think they sell different ones. Oh, the teal one would be perfect. Yeah, I'm gonna have to see if I can find that at some point. Bed. <laughs> Kermie, this is my love palace. Oh my god, Miss Piggy, no! Well, that certainly is a digital clock.
Again, I, I would like to place these on things. I will be able to at some point. That'll go in the uh, the music room when the music room a actually happens. God, am I ever gonna need this many tree branches? I may as well just fucking sell some of them. Jeez. Keep them for tools. I, I know. It's just they're they're everywhere, tree branches. Then you can craft small tables. Let's, let's see. Maybe do that N now? Yes, now. I don't know, I kinda like cardboard boxes. Yeah, wooden block table. Soft wood. I need eight soft wood and wooden block toy. It looks like Babby. Log dining table. Wooden low table. I don't have a lot of regular wood. Yeah, I won't craft this stuff now, but I will eventually. They're not bad. If I need to, I, I craft them. How close are you to getting time-based music? Um, according to... ...chat... ...tomorrow. Customizing tools re uh, resets the hit count. Right, yeah, I, I think it's a hundred uses of the decent tools. But if you go to customize, you can you can keep that stuff. Or you can uh, reset it, yeah. Vinny, how close are you to getting pants? Oh, no, no, it's not happening. This is my deserted island. And I'll be... I'll be goddamned if anyone's gonna... <laughs> Smegbert, hello. Hi, how are you doing? Are you sleeping? Another neat day on Whore Island, doodle duh. Did I not have Egbert in a previous game? If the weather stays this nice, it'll be a starry night tonight. We could see some meteors. Oh, they're... I don't know what meteors are, so I extra want to see one. Okay, well, I definitely have to play on my own later. City folk, maybe? Yeah, I, f I feel like... I feel like I remember having Egbert at some point in a game. I don't know when. Are you rocking a rubber apron? Nice. Looks easy to move in. Watching you move is making me want to move. It's like, oh yeah, I can move. I forget sometimes. I guess Egbert is classified as lazy. Dude was sleeping. I can walk, I can talk, I can move. I can groove. you make the money if there are no ranchulas
Jacob, what the fuck is poggers? Well, I don't know, Mom. Uh, people in the Twitch chat are saying it. Sturgeon. We're gonna get the sturgeon. Come on. Red snapper. Sturgeon would be here and bigger. But I haven't seen a single one yet. Let's go give Louie his birthday present. Why are you digging two holes next to every rock? So that I can... ...get better leverage against the rock. Don't be shy. High dive into the party. I like how he's, he's wearing his suit from yesterday. Ass still very much hanging out. I really appreciate that you, my good friend, stopped by. I'll appreciate it even more if you, my good friend, have a present for me. Appreciate nothing. Did you see those eyes? God, here, have a wasp. Oh, oh wow, did you really- a wasp? You're so cool, I can't believe you got me such an awesome present. I'll gladly accept your generosity, that's a classy way of saying thanks for the gift, bud. Fine, did you come to celebrate with us? Well, now that you're here, the real party can kick off. So glad you and Celia are here to celebrate with me today. It's really nice to have good friends. How old are you guys? Notice that they never age. Well, I'm an old gorilla now, Vine. I remember that wasp you gave me 35 years ago. Those were the good times, but we're all getting old together in real time. Animals that age in real time. The next Animal Crossing. That's the big feature. It's been... It's been fun. Vine. Goodbye. Emmy visit visited want to hear something low-key fab back home they're known as aspiring savant yeah we we already talked about this lay bonkers boy blue bear you're you're getting real close to getting bonked on the head with a net Tail and Brachio Tail. I don't think we... It's fine. You just take both of those. If I get another Brachio thing, then, you know... We'll get the lore. But I'm pretty sure we already got Diplo. We got Diplo lore. I, I might have even gotten one Brachio piece already. Vinny Big Top won't stop Naruto running around the island. What do I do? Dig. 
Wasn't there pitfall? What, what happened to those? The pitfall traps that you can place down. Also, I, I know that I say Naruto wrong. I know it's Naruto. They're still in the game? Oh, okay. You can obtain them later. Nar Naruto. Your mouth has to go a little funny when you when you say it. Otherwise, it's not going to work. 16,000. I wonder if anyone in their town has dinosaurs, like dinosaur bones, just set up across their whole town. I'm sure, I'm sure someone is just not donating to the museum. try to keep my tools in all the spots that I know them to be in. Or at least close to it. You caught a manila clam. That's my favorite fa flavor of clam. Vinny, please say Naruto, but in the funny, slow, warbly voice for my friend. Now, your friend wouldn't happen to be you. Right? Naruto. That's like the least thing I could have ever done for a laugh, and chat is losing their goddamn minds. One person called me a sellout. Do the roar. Speak, speak. Do the roar. What are you streaming tonight? I'm not too sure. Probably Doom. Earbuds combo. Oh, I see. I'm gonna see if I can handle Half-Life Alex tonight. I'd like to play more of it and make progress, but again, it's... I want to make sure, like, I'm... I'm real life. Like, I'm good for it. I think, um, streaming it at the end of the night... is not a good idea. I think if I'm gonna stream it, I have to stream it first. So... But yeah, for the foreseeable future, I'm gonna be working on this game, RimWorld, Doom Eternal, and Half-Life Alex, And then, um... I'm gonna sneak a Dreams stream in there somewhere, too. But I'm just gonna focus on these games for a little bit. Vinny, VR trash this Sunday. Probably not. VR trash is something that I'd like to do, but I'd need a little bit more time. I don't have any specific recommendations, for example, so... I don't really know what accounts for VR trash at the moment, and a lot of it's paid. So there's that. So there's there's a couple different angles to the VR trash situation, but, um, you know, I'm, I'm open to suggestions if anyone has one.
Hi, yes, I'd like to craft fish bait. Uh, seven at a time, please. Like, someone laughs at the expense of motion sickness? God, that would be terrible. No, I think just really shoddy VR experiences, but the, the problem is a shoddy VR experience could actually lead to me getting a little sick. How do you get fast crafting? You just press the A button a lot. Hang on, let me get a drink beverage, chat. Be right back. Okay, hi. No, no ginger ale today. I gotta ration my ginger ale chat. Every, like, three days. What brand do you like? Um, I- I don't have a- I- I'm not a brand loyalist when it comes to ginger ale. <laughs> Just whatever they have is fine. Chat, can I catch the sturgeon? By... using... Cock. Don't take that out of context. Can I catch the sturgeon by using the fish bait? Will that be close enough to the river? Like if I if I do this here? Not there. How about here? Chat seems to think that this can work. Up more? How about here? Whoa, that seems to be a big boy. Fuck. I've got people telling me to get closer to the ocean, and others telling me to get closer to these rocks underwater here. <sighs> Between grass and rocks.
that ain't it. Stand on the sand. Stand in the place where you sand. Now face sands. No, don't you dare. No. What am I doing? I don't have a good feeling about me catching this fish between my poor fishing skills and... Just not knowing how to catch a goddamn sturgeon in the first place. Damn, some of these fishes take- someone said they used a hundred bait to catch a string fish. If we could, like, buy fish bait, that would make this process a little easier. I'm gonna go for string fish again. Let's sell these fish and then try string fish and then we'll check out a different island. Like I said, there's not as much to do today. Apparently tomorrow, there's gonna be a fuckload of things to do. Yeah, Nine Inch Nails released two more Ghosts albums, which are just, like, little instrumentals. It's pretty exciting. Check that out today. Vinny, it's too early for the Stringfish? Check what the item of the day is. Oh, good point. Oh, the ATM is closed, right? I can't even get a ticket for Nook Miles. Stringfish starts at 4 p.m., so I could technically get the Stringfish, but yeah, we can't go to another island today. Wooden wardrobe. Why is the ATM closed? Oh, they're fumigating. There's, um, a rodent problem. Inside here. Inside, um... Nook's area. Oh wait, that's just Tom Nook, he's... Let me get some more clam. Vinny, you can keep clothes in the fridge. Yeah, I, I saw that. I saw you can use the fridge as a... a wardrobe. We New Yorkers love to keep our clothes in the fridge. It keeps them... It keeps them, um, fresh. And rigid. I 
Actually, aren't you supposed to put stuff in the freezer to get rid of... What, what do you... You put clothes in the freezer to get rid of what? Bed bugs or something? Or lice? Germs, like you put shoes. Okay. I know this is disgusting, but we're gonna talk about this for a second. I think there's a way to get rid of bacteria in your shoes by putting them in like a plastic bag and leaving them in your freezer. Maybe not bacteria, but smells. I don't know. This is stuff I've, I've heard over the years. Someone in chat just mentioned it. It reminded me. Is this true? It's haunted to smell. That's correct. Nope. Smells, yes, but... Bacteria, no. Absolutely disgusting. Then your freezer gets stinky. But what if you put it in, in bags? Hey, this frozen pizza tastes like feet. This is disgusting. I definitely don't want to be talking about stuff like this right now because it's making me a little bit nauseous. Has anyone made the pizza joke? Yep, of course. Several people have made it a joke. Well, a joke usually requires clever construction. Right, so when we say the word joke, I don't, I'm not thinking of, like, a stand-up comedian... ...with a nice premise, good delivery, and a punchline. In this case, the word joke is being misused for just funny word. Gilby... What'd you say? Gilby Godfrey? So a moth walks into a podiatrist's office. Why is Vinny dressed like he cooks meth? In the world of Animal Crossing... There are many ways to earn a living. Yeah, I need that damn stringfish, and I need that damn sturgeon before March ends. Uh, any- chat, is there any other Nintendo Direct-related stuff that you want me to talk about? I don't remember the rest of it. The ninja game? Eh. Oh, there, there was Ring Fit DLC with different music. Turns it into, like, a rhythm game. I think Ring Fit had a huge uptick in sales. Or people trying to get Ring Fit, at least. Because of isolation. And... It is really good exercise. Ring Fit is, is a surprisingly good game on its own. And then, as exercise, it's, it's kind of amazing. So... I think it's smart that they're adding some new stuff to it, some music, um, there's a couple different, like, options for the game. It just decent little update all around. There's a jogging mode, where if you just want to jog, you just go for a jog. No, I'm not doing Ring Fit tonight. I'm much too lazy for that, sorry. Someone said Mole Cricket?
It appears there are two. Gotcha. Was that like that in, in the other games? Because I don't think I've ever had to do that before for an insect. Was? Oh. I guess I just never caught that one. Every game? Good for me. How much do they sell for? <laughs> Not much. All right. I hear a balloon. Nice! Tomorrow I can definitely pay off my house. away a couple things. That's it for a stink bug? Ah, uh, what well, is a stinky bug? Didn't he get the clock? That's a nice clock. I might get it. Let's see what my luck is like for the string fish. And then when I come back, I'll sell some stuff and maybe I'll get it. Depending on how well I do. Be warned, there is no... There is nowhere one might hide from the mole cricket. This plump pest has powerful front claws made for digging holes. You know how it loves to burrow underground. A cousin of the grasshopper, it also has wings and can easily take to the air. I swear this is on my pin feathers. Some even have been seen walking on water. Oh mercy, I may need a moment. This is making me feel rather woozy. How is that fair? Like, it's- it's not fair. It can dig. It can fly. It can walk on water. Could you imagine if insects were bigger than humans, or about the same size as humans? The reason we don't have insects like that is because the oxygen... ...the content of- of, of our atmosphere, is it? I've always heard this explanation, and I- and I always forget exactly how it goes down. Millions of years ago, we used to. Atmospheric pressure, temperatures, chemicals in the water. Okay. More oxygen equals bigger bugs. Okay, that's- that's the way I always heard it.
But yeah, it's like in BattleBots, when someone makes a knife robot, and then another person just makes a simple scoop, and the scoop always wins. I feel like the Mole Cricket is just too OP. Like, was not balanced properly. By, um, John Evolution. <laughs> John God? Well, that's a whole other can of worms. Like, when I was, um, at the museum in this game yesterday, someone in chat was like, Yeah, I don't want to play this game because they don't have another viewpoint. Like, I don't- I don't want to be force-fed evolution. It was so, really something like that. I just ignored it, but deep down I was like, that could be bait. It also could be very easily real. I mean, you know, these things can exist in the same world. But then again, I guess dinosaurs were put here by the devil. So that's a whole other... story. The CEO of nature, Big Nature, gave mole crickets wall hacks. Meteor was a balance patch. <laughs> okay, we've got ten chances today to find the stringfish. That's definitely not it. That's what kind of reaction time I have, chat. Didn't fucking Rick and Morty do an episode about giant insects? I shit you not, it turned into a pickle. There's a new show from Justin Roiland that was advertised that, um... It's like aliens on Earth, but it's just Rick and Morty voices. And it's the same animation style. And it looks like, like the American Dad version of Family, like Family Guy to Rick and Morty. It's like one of those things. It just seems like a less interesting version of Rick and Morty. Maybe it'll be good, I don't know, but it really does seem like it's gonna be a, just a watered-down, like, sitcom cartoon about aliens on Earth, Third Rock from the Sun style. We'll see. Someone said American Dad has its funny moments. I've heard American Dad's funnier than Family Guy. I haven't seen American Dad in, like, ten years or more, but... But yeah, spin-offs, man. When a show becomes profitable, you know, you have to have a spin-off. I mean, there are some spin-offs that ended up being really good, like Frasier. You begin to feel the tug of the hallucination. Pull of the hallucination, sorry. I 
heard that fucking thing. It's, there were no presents yesterday, or minimal presents today. Presents all over the goddamn place. Five iron nuggets, okay. Star Trek had good spin-offs. Depending on how much you like Voyager, but Deep Space Nine was excellent. Aren't they sequels? They were, yeah. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Star Trek Picard. Yeah, I still haven't watched the final episode. That's gonna be after this. Oh. Originally, the writer for Picard apparently talked about how his idea for the show was Picard and his dog just going around the vineyard and town just solving local mysteries. Nothing epic. Just really low stakes. Just Picard on Earth. Just being an old man with his dog. I would have been fine with that. Sounds like Scooby-Doo. <laughs> no luck today. Got a couple more days. Vinny, how did you like not Subnautica in the mini direct? I was cooking egg when that direct was on while I was watching it, so I, I think I missed that entirely. How do you like your eggs? It depends. I, I do different things with them. Today was scrambled. I did a little bit of, um... I, I did the Gordon Ramsay method again, which is just very loose scrambled eggs with chives. Um, little milk to cool it down, which ended up being a good idea. Salt, pepper. That's pretty much it. But I like fried eggs as well, on bread. With cheese. Vinny, you remember yesterday when you mocked that chat member for saying that there was a direct today? I think mocked might be a strong word, but I don't remember that specifically. Maybe I... did I? Oh. Yeah, I had no inclination that there would be a direct today. Usually they announce it with a couple days in advance. You owe John Chat an apology. Okay, I'm sorry, John Chat. Good call. Vinny absolutely destroys chat member over fictional Nintendo Direct using facts and logic. Said someone in chat. Oh, should I check on those rare flowers? Maybe there, there will be a rare insect? Let's do that real quick. There's not much else to do, um, aside from catching bugs and fishing. Which is all well and good, to a certain degree. P. 
peacock butterfly? I think I already had that. You should have the peacock butterfly. I, I tell you what, I don't have the snails and I didn't donate a rantula. What's Blue Bear doing? Blue Bear's doing yogurt. Butterfly gone. Peeps love to spend time here since it's all wide open and empty. But don't you think the plaza would be a tray amazing venue for a rock show starring me? Oh. She, it's Blue Bear is very Miss Piggy like. Starring moi. It's also a little contemporary with the use of peeps, so I'm getting like slight Britney vibes. No rare insects yet. There's so many goddamn weeds on this island. How you get Zelda ladder. I don't even remember how I got the Zelda ladder. Meat Beach. A uh, uh, nuke? Yeah, it was nuke that gave it to me then. Okay, not much else to do. Tomorrow will be a fun one. Today, I'm just gonna return to my hibernation. I might play a little bit on my own, if anything. I'm gonna get that clock, though. Yeah, if this was the Zelda ladder, you'd be able to use it to cross the, um... ...the rivers. Look at all these 4K bells! Just flying money. And someone said nature is beautiful. <laughs> yes, it is. Someone said I could make the weeds into, like, haystacks and sell them for more. However, I think for the nook miles, I have to actually sell the weeds. Sadly, you do. Vinny, are you gonna stream the shooting stars later? No. 
I'm not going to stream. I'm going to play. I'm not going to stream it. Like, I'll make sure to get them, but yeah, I'm, I'm just going to stream whatever else I stream later. Maybe Doom. Maybe Half-Life Alex again, if I'm feeling up to it. I have to be strong. You know what I mean? Like, I, I need strong constitution. But then, if I am strong, I will stream Half-Life Alex. Oh, let's see what Egbert's doing real quick. Egbert looks worried. Hey, I feel like I've seen you a lot today. Am I seeing you a lot? Or do I just feel that way? Someone said, nice to know you saw my posts now instead of acknowledging them when I said them. Could have just said something then. <laughs> Chat member, I appreciate your advice. I It wasn't even you that I got it from. Friend? But I hope, um... I hope spring makes me real darn sleepy and hungry, so does summer and fall. You're talking about the, the weeds turning into hay? Uh, and winter, too. Yeah, don't worry about it, dude. It's all good. I got the info from wherever I got the info from. It was both tweeted to me and typed in chat today and yesterday. So maybe it was you, but I mean... You know... The streaming is a tricky business. It's not a one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, the frog. Maybe I should visit the frog real quick. God damn it, no. Oh. Place them wherever the fuck you want, too. Yeah, I love this. I love this mode. Definitely a good addition to the game, even though it was in New Leaf with touchscreen. Glow S. But, yeah, we got some illumination on the two ducks. Again, some more floor lights I think would make this place nice. I want let me just check one quick thing. I want to see if I can customize these. Vinny, your room makes me feel sad. It makes me feel sad too, which is the comfort blanket. Nope, can't customize them. Luckily, it's the exact color I wanted anyway, so Number one and number two. Scoot. 
and America's Choice Scoot. Well, time to go to sleep on my trash bed. Alright, yeah, today was a pretty light day of Animal Crossing chores and duties and things, but tomorrow I think will be a lot more fun. Looking forward to it. We didn't even visit the frog. <laughs> I forgot to visit the frog. <laughs> Sorry, Diva. I don't really even care about the frog all that much. Chat is posting frog faces. See, I feel like we got the Diva experience just from the frog faces in chat. Here, chat, look, let's visit... Let's visit Diva now, shall we? There she is. Alright, I'll be back later on with uh, some more streaming. So stop by then if you want to watch some other shooting games and stuff. Thanks everybody. It's nice to do these early Animal Crossing streams for a little bit. So, thank you once again. Um, if you want to watch some other streamers while I'm not here, you can just wait for the auto-host. That'll take you to a ton of different streamers. Oh, there's multiple of me. Um, Ima Cooney's live, I, I would assume, with more Animal Crossing. Mm -hmm. So, and my mods usually stream around this time too, some of them. So check them out. Um, they're very good people. And uh, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. And stay healthy, stay safe. Stay the fuck out of a crowd, and um, take care of yourselves, okay? And each other. Goodbye. See you later.